I'd like to take you to the role of government in the sort of news sector. And looking forward over the next few years, how interventionist do you think government should be in supporting the news sector, if at all? And what do you think would constitute uh, government overreach? You should stay the hell out of it. You don't know anything about it. You're only trouble. We're not on your side. You're not on our side. We're different. I mean, relations between journalists, or journalists, media, and government should always be bad and never in any account be allowed to get better. So I don't want any of your help. We, I've rebuilt the spectator without any help from anybody here or any government or any tax incentives or any intervention. You know, you, you can't even keep the streets safe at night. The Scottish government can't build two bog standard ferries. This parliament can't build a single high, high speed line. So stay out of news. You're just trouble. Don't want any help. Just don't want you to interfere. I don't want your tax subsidies. Uh, I don't want your help. I want you just to concentrate on what, you know, I'm a Jeffersonian. The government should concentrate on doing what only government can do and do it well. We have government that concentrates on doing far too much, all of which it does badly. So please, so we, we have gone through a major industrial upheaval, a major technological revolution. And we've come through the other side. We've lost people by the wayside. At times it seemed like the Batan death march. Um, but we've come through. And we now know what we're doing. And we just want to be allowed to get on with it. <laughs>